Of course, at ECAB, we like to plug into the hottest events, and today we are here at Africa's Next Supermodel. And Africa's Next Supermodel is actually an event that brings together 17 girls, and they come together and they compete to who will become Africa's Next Supermodel. Today is the first time that it's happening in Nairobi, and actually from now on, it's going to be happening in Nairobi, strictly in Kenya. And so today we're excited as ECAB, we are here to bring you the best, and we are here with obviously the amazing guests, amazing designers, amazing models. The girls are killing it. It's amazing. It's an amazing show. So I want you guys to just come check it out and let's have fun. mother and I found her very interesting and she said that she would like to speak to us and I said of course I would like to hear what she has to tell us about this beautiful event and about how beautiful herself and you let me know just let me know about your name mm. you said your name is Queen Mother yes I actually received the name Queen Mother for over 50 years of humanitarian service in Africa yes. I was installed in Ghana in a village with the king okay in Ghana and I came to Kenya actually to lecture at the university. I teach business and entrepreneurship at USIU Africa. Wow. Yeah. So you tell me about this event. It's Africa's next supermodel. How are you linked to it? I'm into it because I read that the girls and the guys involved in this show 
are all from refugee camps. And so Queen Mother has in her heart for people who are disadvantaged, whatever they may be, people with disability, human trafficking, refugee camps, my heart goes out to people in those areas, and those are the areas I've been working in for the last 25 years. Yeah, and with the ladies after they win, do you know what happens or how their lives change after this? Well, first off, just the amount of confidence that they get from being a part of an event like this, number one. Number two, the top winners do win money. The top winners, 5,000 USD. They used to get cars, but then they stopped doing that and now they're giving them money prizes. But in addition to that, the ladies get to do some studies. They get to learn about makeup. They get to learn about hair. They get to work on their own bodies in terms of health, learning about eating right, healthy eating, uh, you know, a good diet. Yes. It took me over a year to do this. Yeah. A year. Yeah. Okay. And well, I've been on this journey for over 15 years uh, from Nigeria's Next Supermodel. And now, you know, so for me, it is an amazing journey. Yeah. And unfortunately, uh, there are so many, so many young girls that we would have loved to take care of. Yeah. So we are, we are launching our uh, hope bags. So if you have money to buy the hope bags, every dime that we sell from the hope bag will go towards helping these young men and women. Yeah. And an event like this, what does it take to put it together? Because it's very a intricate. Lot <laughs> a lot of money. I mean, you can see a lot of money. So um, for the young girls who are coming next, right, what advice do you have to give them? First, I'll start with Miss 2017, Miss Nigeria. What advice do you have to give to the winner of this year's um, Africa's Next Supermodel? What advice would you give her? Okay, my advice to the beautiful girl who is going to win today will be you have to be patient you have to always pray to god believe in god trust in yourself and listen to mama <laughs> what about you what would you advice would you give her what i would tell them is to be patient as she said because everything takes time and the more you understand her the more you can get whatever you want in life like has to me so I started in 2019, then right now I can be able to take care of my family, I can take care of my sibling. So that's why we should be patient because we don't know what we're going in, she knows and yeah.